Well, hey, it's Simi with you here again. I just wanted to give you a little brief fractal update. We're here at one of these wonderful farmers markets in uh, Lower Manhattan, and we came across the wonderful Romanesco cauliflower. Now, the Romanesco, if you know anything about it, is a blend between a broccoli and a cauliflower, which means it's got wonderful fractal shapes just for you. Now, take a look at this. This is a perfect example of a Fibonacci sequence. You can see this kind of growth curve and it spirals around the Romanesco in a beautiful way. So each one is in a ratio of 1.6 to one of the previous size, which is the phi ratio, which we've talked about before. You may have read in my book, Opening Minds. But here's the wonderful thing about it. It's not just phi ratios once over. It's multiple phi ratios because the little Romanescos here also have phi ratios within them, which makes this a fractal shape, right? Because it's self-similar. So if you look at some of these bigger sprouting buds here, they also look like a miniature version of the whole Romanesco. And then if you look on those, it's a mini version of that larger bud. So the whole thing reproduces itself in this self-similar scaleless fashion no matter what scale you look at you see the same pattern over and over again which makes this the perfect example of a fractal which is the way that your body is built and, and nature and trees and things and as we've often talked about before if societies were built more according to a fractal shape they'd be much more resilient and robust and anti-fragile right because the system repeats itself in many ways across the same structure, which makes it a very strong and robust um, organically grown shape, which can resist a lot of stress and strain and keep growing. And it's also packed with nutrients and lots of minerals. So here is the broccoli romanesco, nature's natural fractals. Thought you'd enjoy that. If you have any other thoughts about fractals, let me know. Okay, thanks a lot, and we'll talk to you soon. Take care for now. Bye.